It's so close. I can almost hear it. Oh, that looks so cool. Wait. No, I can't. I can't hear anything. Why can't I hear anything? Oh, do you mind that? Do everybody, it's your boy Bloodhead Ninja, man. We back with another man. Before we do anything, y'all already know the deal. Go down to my screen about find me all my social media. Make sure y'all tell me y'all for my channel, man. Hey, yo, y'all, we about to get back to our reaction, y'all. We about to get back to the Empathy Erase. So, this is Empathy Erase Part Episode 4 Reflection. You know, if y'all want to watch all my Empathy Erase videos, man, they would be in this playlist right here. It's gonna be in the card right here. Make sure y'all check that out, man. Give it support. Um, Last last episode was so crazy, man. We finally found out what uh mirror mirror empathy was, man. It's for, it's basically called fragile. I guess she like can break stuff easy. I'm not sure about it yet. We better get more into it on this episode. So I'm excited for what people been telling me about this episode right here. And it's gonna be exciting. Look, my what's the name? Sorry, it's it gonna be exciting. So I'm really excited for it, man. I'd like to say also, man, thank y'all so much for the support on the Empathy the Race uh series, man. We're gonna be Keep bringing them out, man. We're gonna be putting them out hard. Every episode, I'm gonna try to put them out at least every week. I'm gonna try to put at least every week or every two weeks. I don't know. Every week, it's gonna be like every week, twice, two every week. I don't know yet. Just depending on it, man. Depending on what all I got to react to right now. So y'all already know how we gonna do on this channel, man. Y'all wanna watch the original video? Be in the script below. Y'all wanna rock out me? Just tell the video. Let's get it. Hey, hold on. To do today, feel proud and wipe your eyes because they stifle the honest state up till dawn. Let's see what you've been working on. Hey, you know. mind the deadline is closing. Me. Your byline, I'm ready for her. Like I said, I'm ready. Oh, him. Mm -hmm. What's going on? You'll have to crunch and work till dawn till you die. Cut out the corners, cross the teeth, and dead the eyes. Move out the white, I'm gonna keep it in good taste. Just so that no one will ever know it's defaced. Epithet erased. Who ever sing on it? Who ever do a sing on this? Need a fucking Grammy. I like a mirror. I get this a bad story. Honey, your mother and I are going out, okay? Okay. Stay in bed this time, okay? You're not well. You'll be healthy enough to play outside with the other kids soon, dear. Oh, okay. she's sick. Goodbye, sweetie. So you're gonna leave your kid? No babysitter? Kinda fucked up. Hmm? Episode four. So it's four. The reflection. reflection. I guess we get into a backstory now. Oh, never mind. I won't go. But why ever not? Lady Mara <laughs> is waiting. Why ever not? Because I don't wanna! Giovanni. Boss stood up for me. He got hurt for me. And he says I should stand up for myself. I don't want to have here. my epithet taken away. But there you go. You must. Lady Mara needs it. I'm sorry, uh -oh. but I need it too. Molly dashes off towards the exit, but she finds her path blocked by a berry. There you go. I'm sorry, miss. But as a fellow bodyguard, you must understand. I must do as Lady Mara commands. And she commands that, that I capture hands. you! Ah, no, no, no! Um, she runs her hand along the sand in the desert exhibit, piling it up in her palm. As if this reaches out to Give grab her, she sprays it up into his eyes. Ah, sand! Ooh. Sand in my eyes! The third worst place for sand to be! No, Miss Bodyguard! The first, the first one is. First, first and second is. <sighs> Not bad, kid. That power of yours is actually pretty impressive. I think I'll take it. You're no museum worker. You're just another thief. Aww. I love how you be standing. What was your first clue? <laughs> oh my god. Your move, genius. I, quite literally, am a genius. Which means I'm smart enough to know that I shouldn't hold back. Let's see what you're most afraid of. Nightmare fuel! Hmm. What? Why didn't it... What I'm most afraid of? You want to know what I'm most afraid of? I'm afraid of this. 
I'm afraid of a world where I spend the rest of my life like this. Brittle and creaking and constantly on the verge of breaking. I'm afraid of a life where someone bumping up against me on the street needs a trip to the hospital. Wow. I'm afraid that this is all there is. But now I finally have an exit. I finally have a way to leave. You think you can keep me here? Then you better be ready to die trying. Also ducks, apparently. They're small and fast and they fight, okay? Uh, whatever. Just die or something. Molly hops the rope and skips up the stegosaurus skeleton, climbing her way to the top of the Ooh. wall. She takes a hesitant step onto Buckle. the barrier prison and holds it like a tightrope. Hey, kid, hey there, what wait. are you doing? That's dangerous. Don't worry, I'm going to get you out of here. Boss needs our help. Boss? Wait a second. What are you talking about? Miss? Miss? Uh oh. No time. Please, just trust me. Ah, there you are. Ah, Don't there move. you are. I am coming to apprehend you. Oh, no. I've been caught. I sure hope this barrier underneath me doesn't disappear. Then I'd have nowhere to run. <laughs> you are right. Secret technique. Unbarrier. Unbarrier. I got gotcha. you. Thanks. Boss is in the next room over. This big guy beat him up. He's trying to catch me, and I need your help to get away from him. Okay. We'll do our best. We're the Bonsai Blasters! Nobody messes with us. He got Prepare a to meet voice. your doom! I, uh... Well, mm. they tried their bargain bin best. But they bought me a few seconds and Too that's all top. I needed. Don't, Molly don't dips under the rope and begins crawling up the tail oh, of the Apollosaurus! Hey! Get off of there! One does not ride a mighty dinosaur without its permission! Barrier! Molly roots around in her back and pulls out the gun Giovanni gave her. She looks at it for a second and then chucks it at the base of the bones. Hey, do not throw guns. I'm a bad guy do now. Not throw guns. I can do what I want. The dinosaur wibbles and wobbles. Its bones creak ominously as the beast begins to collapse. You should reposition your barriers if you want to save the dinosaur. <laughs> no, I do. I do want to save the dinosaur. <laughs> She's just fucking him up the whole time, bro. Right? <sighs> Thank goodness. Molly shimmies her way up the neck and hops into a nearby air vent on the ceiling. Mm. Hey, hey, no, 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 no. Hey, 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 no, 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 no. no. She gone, man. <sighs> okay, he shouldn't be able to follow me up Molly's here. smart. <sighs> what are those lights up ahead? Scoot. 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 All right, let's Scoot. group up into teams of three and sweep the building. We uh -oh. don't know what's going on, how many perps there are, so or the whether police. there are. Okay. Whoa, look at all the policemen. I didn't think so many would show up. That's good. I shouldn't have to worry about Mr. Indus anymore. Whoa! Oh my god. Is that man carrying a dinosaur? Little bodyguard! Yep. Where did you go? Oh! Hello, police. 9618, we have a 9618 in progress. Subject to I already know what that means, but okay. Bronto, possibly a Potosaurus. Requesting backup immediately. Do it huh. matter what the hell it well, is? Just this get is him. awkward. That should be a good enough distraction. I need to get back to the others before the police find them. Scoot, scoot. Scoot, scoot. Scoot, scoot. Scoot, scoot. Scoot, scoot. Epithet erased. Commercials are like a barrier on your TV. Oh, his tattoo represents sun and, and uh... Epithet erased. I ain't gonna read the other one. Yeah, we're back. Counting sheep! Mm. Is, is that all you got? She gets that. Oh. I see. So. Your body is too frail for your own epithet. You can't keep this up. So it's when she uses it, her body gets Counting injured. Sheep. Oh, that's Defend crazy. Me. All I have to do is survive until your own power knocks you out. You think you can outlast me? You'd better watch your step. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, shit. She Mirror. Uh, she grabs Sylvie's chest and clasps her fingers. His ribs turn brittle and his breath chokes. Ah! 
you feel that? She can turn people brittle too. Feel like drywall on the verge oh of my caving. Oh god. god. That's how I feel all the time. Most people who train their epithet figure out new powers and ways to get around their weaknesses. <laughs> Not me. The more I train, the stronger my epithet grows, the weaker I get. Mm. The only new trick I found is the ability to suck stamina out of other people. All I can do is steal from others. Mm. So when I heard about this amulet, I figured why not lean into it. Let me show you. No! I won't let you! Yeah! Take this! Yeah! Did he I'm seriously gonna... pass out from oh, the shock? Oh, he really do oh, it. Meanie. Uh oh. Half of my bones are broken uh -oh. right now, and you don't hear me Damn, complaining. Half? Much. Doctor Beck. Doctor oh, Beck. That's yeah. new. Mmm. See. Ow. Oh great. That's still happening. Beef that stops the ground. Doctor Beef. He levels his horns and prepares to charge. Oh great. Let's see you get through those. <laughs> I wasn't serious. <laughs> I wasn't the ground, serious. And a wall of crystalline spikes shoot out from the rubble beneath. <laughs> Beefton will enjoy examining your cadaver. Bam! 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 Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it! She pulls her fist and, with a moment of hesitation, takes it into the wall behind her, breaking at least two of her fingers. <laughs> Fissure snakes up from the impact, creeping up, up, up the wall and into the ceiling. Crack, crack, crack! It crisscrosses until a chunk of the roof has been completely encircled. Uh. Something, something, bull in a china shop. You better run, baby. That's a pretty bad one-liner, but no one's around to hear it, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> ah! You were there too. Damn it! Damn. I should have said something cool after all. Wait. No, this is perfect. Come here. Ah! Mara's hand reaches what? to grab hold of Molly's epithet. The amulet glows in unsettling green as her nails kick, move. Kick, kick the leg. Kick the leg. Kick the leg. Kick the leg. Back. Don't touch her. Fine. If you can't wait your turn, I'll take your epithet first. Yes. Yes. The amulet glimmers and an orange aura surrounds the boy. It dances for a moment, fleeting, and then rushes along Mara's outstretched arm into the gem of the arson amulet. Wow, <laughs> she actually stole the oh, I can feel it. All your strength, all your powers, they're mine. Thank you for your contribution to the museum's collection, kid. What Damn, did he call Sammy? that ability again? Oh, right! Nightmare fuel! Oh, oh that's shit. much better. I can get used to this. Now it's your turn, little girl. Wait! Endus got captured by the cops! Don't you need to go and help him? He... Uh, that idiot. Well, it's his own stupid fault. He can get out of it himself. But... Don't you like him? Huh? Well, I'm, I mean, he's free labor, but... You sound like my dad. It's nice to have someone looking out for you. You shouldn't take it for granted. I so, don't take life advice from a toddler. And don't bother looking for a that. way she out. No toddler. She's no key. Escape. Get it right. She reaches for Molly. And just told me about your epithet. If it really hurts so much, then why? Why don't you just have somebody use the necklace to steal it away? You could get rid of it. And what? Lose That's what little I've gained from all my effort the past 10 years? This training? This is all I have. Why should I have to throw away all my hard work? You shouldn't. <laughs> it's not fair. I know it's not. The world never is. But that doesn't mean you should make other people hurt instead. True. If you act a little nicer, you get a little nice back. Usually. Just net, net to change and break. Quiet. Oh, I see. If you say so. So what if other people get hurt, huh? I've been hurting my whole life. I just wanted to stop for ten minutes. Is that so wrong? 
And now it's here. The answer is right here. I just had to reach out and grab it. A new life. It's so close. I can almost hear oh, it. Oh, that looks so cool. Wait. No, I can't. I can't hear anything. Why can't I hear anything? Oh, do you mind? Uh... Ooh. KO. <sighs> now that's what I call a bear trap. Right. <laughs> Giovanni struts over to Mera's unconscious body, leans down, and takes the Arsen amulet from her. Bring it. The battle is over. That was amazing, boss. Yeah. Super cool. The fuck you came from? <laughs> well, you Why know, she in the box? all in a day's work. Plus, I gained a ton of proficiency from winning that battle. And all that smoke gave me an idea for a new move. Check it out. Hoo-wah! Giovanni spreads his arms and the area around him is blanketed in a fog as thick as pea soup. Not bad, huh? Pea so, soup. what do you think of the fog of lost souls? It smells delicious, boss! I love you! I love you more! Also, it heals you if you stand in it. Just like real what? souls. Uh, what happened? You totally, Dr. Beef. If it heals you, ain't you healing the like other girl? A nerd. Luckily for you, the bonsai blaster saved the day. Can I please have my epithet back? Only if you beg. Never, cretin. Oh, well, that's a shame. You better I beg. guess your epithet belongs to the bonsai blasters now. No, I want it. I want it, I want it, I want it, I want it. Give it back. Boss, come on. What's that bear trap? I can't hear it when you mumble like that. If you want something, speak up. Boss, give it back to him. Please. Okay, fine. But only because bear trap asked so nicely. Gotta give her some positive reinforcement after all. You're lucky I'm such a good mentor. Molly walks over and presses the amulet to Sylvie. The orange aura returns to him. Thank you. You're welcome. Well, I guess all's well that ends well. Police do him. <laughs> Police do him. Freeze, criminals! Talk to him. All right. Damn, we got his chance. Well, well, well. The notorious bonsai blasters. We should have known you were behind this. That's right, Ooh, coppers. We're not scared of you or your little pea shooters. This museum's treasures are ours for the taking. We shall see. The woman steps forward and unsheathes a real ass goddamn sword and points it at them. <laughs> a real Whoa. ass goddamn Is sword. That a real ass sword? <laughs> Holy crap. We don't mess around with no real ass goddamn swords. That's out of our pay grade. Mm -mm, we're done. Indeed. That's what your friends said before we captured them. Damn. Oh, cheesy guys. And one of those two. Are these youths also part of your criminal cavalcade? She gestures towards Sylvie and Molly. <laughs> As if the bonsai blasters would never hire some snot-nosed little kids. These two are our hostages, so you'd better not shoot. He lifts Molly up and places her in front of him. Oh no! I am an unwilling hostage! I hope I am not hit! <laughs> not the most gun, fake the goddamn what's a real ass goddamn sword! Hey gads! She swore. A real ass and goddamn I don't feel sword. Bad about it! My innocent youth is already being corrupted by bad guy proximity! No! <gasps> Stand down, man. <laughs> That's right. You Molly want to is hit bad one now. of those hostages oh. through the fog by mistake. Through the fog. Through the fog. What fog? The fog of lost souls. <laughs> <laughs> what? Where did they go? So long, suckers. We'll meet again soon, Bear Trap. See you later, Gumbas. Curses! Split up and search for them. We can't let them get away. Hey, that's I'll a good ass move to citizens. escape. Yes, ma'am. And who in the world is Bear Trap? Bear Trap. Epithet erased. Bye. Epithet <laughs> Bye. 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 funny.
You think he'll be okay? Not to worry. He sustained some minor injuries, but I think he'll pull through. It's a good thing he managed to get his epithet back, though. A dangerous artifact like that amulet simply cannot be left in the hands of criminals. And I'm afraid this is going to be the start of a lot of work for the police force. I wish I got a chance to examine it up close. <coughs> Call the number on that card when you get a room at the hospital, okay? I'll send over some get well toys from the store. Uh, thanks. Aww. Molly? Um, did you mean it? When you said you would be my friend? Sure. If you want me to be. Uh. Oh, that's cute. Yeah. See you. I hope. Oh. No! Hey, Damn. Watch the eyes. Well, the eyes. I've wrapped up most everything here, but I'm afraid we still can't seem to get a hold of your father. <sighs> yeah, that's right. Where's dad in the world? Ow! Careful with those handcuffs, all right? I apologize for getting us captured, Lady Mera. I will do my best to scoot, so you may scoot. have as much room as possible. Shut up, Indus. Mera sighs and squeaks in behind him. She grimaces as her broken bones press against Indus's girth. Mm. She's used to it. Molly walks over before they shut the door. Uh, careful, citizen. Just because they're wearing eraser cuffs doesn't mean they aren't dangerous. It'll be okay. What do you want? I'm sorry I couldn't give you my epithet. Really, I am. I just... I needed to deal with stuff at home for a while. But I can at least do this much for you. She gently takes Mara's hands in her own and closes her eyes. There's a moment of serene quiet. For the first time in a long while, Mara doesn't feel... anything. No discomfort, no pain, just quiet. <sighs> I hope that makes your car ride Aww. a little nicer at least. <laughs> if you ever want me to help with that in the future, just ask. You know, once you get out of jail. She doesn't say anything. Then just kind of elbows her. <laughs> Thank you. Right, David, come on, say something. <laughs> Can I get a ride home? Thank you very much for driving me. You're quite welcome. I know things didn't go quite as expected today. <laughs> Real but ass I sore. hope you got the chance to learn something on your field trip. Yeah. I think I did. Molly reaches for her keys. But the door is already unlocked. Huh? <sighs> Dad. She turns and waves to the police lady. Good night. Hmm. What an adorable young sprog. She is adorable. Molly flips the close sign to open and starts her shift at 11 p.m. She ain't get no sleep. At night! You know what? No. Flip. I'm going to bed. There you go. Take your butt to bed. 11 fucking, who the fuck open at 11, 11 p.m. at night? What kind of fuck is up? 11 p.m. Alright. Oh, new character. Damn, she took. Hey. Hey. How you go? Did you get the emblem? LOL? Nope. Oh. <laughs> what happened? Did you get caught? Oh, that's bad. Yep, yep. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, shit. Everybody get real next episode. Alright, man, I hope y'all enjoyed the video. Y'all did. Make sure y'all smash that like button. You did. Make sure y'all hit the dislike button, man. Also, hit the red button and subscribe, man. Come part of the Blonde Head Crew, man. Hit the bell right next to it so you know what other new content like this, man. Hey, man. Hey, it's good to know Mirror Story and, like, how.
her power actually hurt her. That's crazy. For y'all, y'all want to know what somebody asked, somebody asked what in, what do I be watching back there? That actually Night Blue Three. I watched some of his uh clips. I'm a big League of Legends fan, so I've been watching Night Blue Three. Like uh, I've been watching a lot of like different uh solo solo uh solo Renekli only. I've been watching a lot of them like clips and stuff just to get to learn the more the game more. But beside it. Episode 5 about to be crazy, y'all. I'm ready for They already dropped the episode. I'll probably upload. I'll probably react to it next week. I want to get these videos, like, a week apart. You know, just to get, like, you know, just to get a week apart. Just don't want to drop it every day. So, it, episode 5 will happen next week. I don't know what day, but it will happen next week. But, um, hey, man. Like I said, man, it's cool just to see, um, Mirror, new, Mirror Power. It's grown as hell. She's grown as hell. Um, it sucks that it hurt her, and the uh, only reason she tried to steal the amulet just to get it out, but she could have just, you know, take the take the shit out, take take the power out. But the new oh, the new people about to go crazy. They about to go beat Giovanni up and steal the amulet back. Oh man, they about to be crazy, man. But look, man, tell me what y'all think about the video in the comments below, and tell me what y'all want to next, and I see you on the next video. I am out.